Good day to you. Hope things are going well. This is David Richard Amo, Balancing the Tribe, Body, Mind, Spirit. And yes, I am rather late today. Normally I try to get this thing be done between 2 and 2.30 in the afternoon. And right now it's almost 3.30, I think, is what I got here. If I can, yep, almost 3.30 here. So late, which actually is part of the topic. So, <clears throat> Balancing the Tribe. Basically it's kind of taking your body, mind, spirit which is what it is, but you're working on your health and wellness, whatever that is in your area, whatever main area has the interest for you, but you're taking that, working on it deep, and then as a result of it, you get to handle life's challenge a little easier, a little better than what you may have done before. This is what I learned when I went in and for a simple procedure, woke up and woke up in ICU the next day, got a nasty diagnosis the week after, and eight hour surgery the week after that, I handled it all okay, all because I was taking care of myself, and basically the inside out. So in simple terms, that's what I'm doing. I'm sharing with you so that way there you can learn faster and learn what I've gone through and hopefully save yourself some of the mistakes. And part of that today is it is the mistake but realizing it's okay, it does happen. And I've been working on, well, consciously balancing the tribe for at least six plus years now. Even though I've worked on it many years before that, I've been doing it a couple of decades now, but I wasn't quite consciously aware of the whole pieces together. And then I got a little more serious about the past two and a half years or so, three years. So the more I share, the more I learn, the more I start learning about, the more it kind of evolves, develops, the more I start to change. But at the same time, I still make mistakes. I still screw up on it. And part of that was today. Now, if you've been watching me for a while, you know, one of the things is with, like with rest. I want to try getting up and going to bed and getting up at the same time. If you've also been following me, you know, going to bed is my hard part. Getting up, I was okay for the most part. Uh, but a couple of days ago, might have been yesterday morning, um, Got to sleep late the night before, so when I woke up at 5 o'clock, it's like, okay, this ain't going to cut. I need a little extra sleep, so I reset my alarm. Got up and got on with my day. However, I forgot to reset the alarm for this morning, so I got up late. Now, no big deal. I could have just gone on the day, but I let myself get distracted because there are certain things I do in the morning, which normally carries me through the day. Well, I'm an hour short this morning. I didn't quite take that completely into consideration. So it kind of threw my day off a little bit. I had a meeting this morning on Zoom, and then I let myself get distracted. Yes, literally, I let myself get distracted. Instead of doing some productive work, I got myself doing busy things, basically non-productive stuff. So from there, I, let, I got into a workout. My workout was going late. Definitely a tough session today. I had to take longer rest between sets, and then <clears throat> it... um. Recovery was longer afterwards. I got done, finished eating lunch late. And so just a lot of compound factors, which is then why I'm getting in here. All that to say is, sorry, I keep getting message on my phone here. Um, all I have to say is, look, I still screw up. I still make it up. But with all that, no matter what happens to you, just keep going. Keep taking those baby steps. I was able to get my workout in. I'm going to get the meditation in. I'm making sure I put positive thing, things in my mind. But it's going through and say, you stumble. You just keep going. You start up the next, if it's with food related, you start up the next meal. With exercise, you do what you can today or start up again the next day. Let the stumbles just be okay. It's part of the journey. What can you learn from that? Now I'm learning. I still got some areas to work when I get myself behind. And I'm still working on some of the mindset. Certain things I got down, I can share people, I can help you with those things easily. I'm still working on myself. I'm an ever going project. Matter of fact, that's a topic I wasn't, I'm going to talk about probably about tomorrow. Excuse me, but just realize you stumble up, you make mistakes, and we're human. Oh, or at least mostly human. I'll let you talk about that one there. But regardless, hey, stumble, you get off track, things happen, it's all right. But when it happens, just realize it's okay. Keep going. Keep taking those baby steps. Keep taking those micro goals if you need to and you get right back yourself going in as long as you make that decision to realize okay i'm going to get going again i'm going to get going the next hour i'm going to get the next project the next meal the next day whatever it is as long as you choose to keep going you're back right back on track all right so hopefully that all made sense for you and that's uh it's beneficial for you let me know your thoughts on that about how you get yourself on track if you do a stumble or what happens when you stumble have you said have you let yourself just fall i stumbled that's it i can't do more i screwed up that's it. I'm done. Or you say, okay, I made a little stumble. Let me get up and keep going again. Just let me know your thoughts on that. 
All right, we will take you care. So this is actually on a Friday. So enjoy the start to your weekend, and we will catch you tomorrow. So take care and bounce it to you. Bye-bye.